though experimental work, this is one of the workbenches we have in our uh, Hummer Works, which is our R&D laboratory. And we were checking out a few things. This is one of our surface mount circuit boards that we use in our soldering stations. And uh, we've been troubleshooting some of these surface mount components. What's nice with uh, these EZP-01 probe is we've taken some components off there and if we want to check the value of them it's quite easy you just can squeeze like that's uh, 300 and some ohms and then you'll notice it's a little lower around the 200 mark and then you can use these probes to put them back on with the hot air but right now uh, we want to use these probes and check out a particular device for taking it off a thermal load which we don't know what that load is but we're going to take this and melt it onto this copper plate that will simulate the circuit board that this component's on we're also going to check the heat that is around this so we can gradually heat the area rather than thermal shock the component all at once but the way we're doing it it could ruin the component so we want to be sure that we know the components bad and then get it off and then figure out a, a gentle way to get it back on all this takes gets done in steps so right now we'll go ahead and heat this area up with the hot air flow the component on and then we'll go in and take it off to show you how we can do it in the lab which will be different than what you're doing it because we haven't seen the uh, circuit because uh, it's a proprietary type operation that you have so we're just giving it our best guess we usually just get thermal loads get the thing working and we're approximating your conditions there so uh, I'll get back with you as soon as I get this mounted back on there so that'll give us an idea and could preheat a little bit. Come off pretty good. It's just that it would overheat if so getting them back on is going to be even trickier and require some engineering time to evaluate different ways that we could do it. But what we used here is pretty much uh, within our capability uh, to provide. The only thing we have to do is put the air nozzle inside that tip, but we sell that size tip. So all this is available except for that. Well, that's the work that we've done on this so far. We use our probes here. Works nicely for picking these up. You sure see that that's still pretty good shape. There it is. Uh, that was set on the station and the flow, and then we have a foot pedal on the floor, and that starts the air, and we'll see how that heats up. Pretty quick. So it's going to take practice to do the thing, so and chances are you'll get more skillful at this than we are, hopefully. See what step you would like to take next, and uh, we'll see if we can come up with a mutual proposal that would benefit both of us. So this is soldering 101.